Hello and welcome back to our Optic Straight YouTube channel. Today I will talk about Minox X Active 10x25 binoculars. Minox is a respected brand company from Germany and the company is probably best known for manufacturing spy cameras with the highest quality lenses in the world. They also offer binoculars, monoculars, spotting scopes and rifle scopes with, with incredible optical performance and compact design. X-Active series is a brand new series from Minox launched in 2019. This series offers versatile applications thanks to four different objective diameters. So uh, they are 25, 33, 44 and 56 mm objective lens. All binoculars have a good optical performance with neutral color rendition and high contrast. These incredibly versatile binoculars are hand-friendly, waterproof and have incredible optical features. They are all made in China. There are two models available with 25mm objective lens, so 8x25 and 10x25. They belong to the pocket binoculars category, which are one of the smallest in the company uh, in the category of binoculars. They are small, lightweight and very easy to hold in hands and carry around the neck. So they are perfect for birding, traveling, safari or any outdoor observations such as sport events or concerts. Okay, so let's see the design of the 10x25 X-Active binoculars. As you can see, they have really distinct Minox design. Everyone who knows Minox binoculars can immediately recognize their design. They are made out of aluminium and finish is in black rubber. Thanks to the robust housing, the X-Active series is well protected against outside influences. A nitrogen filling prevents fogging from the inside and they are also waterproof according to IPX7. You can also see some markings on binoculars. Here is the name of the manufacturer and the name of the series and here is the magnification and objective lens diameter 10 by 25. To ensure smaller dimensions and compactness they have a roof prism system that offers better optical technology. So they feature face corrected Schmidt Peham roof prism. They have open bridge design with a single hinge so they can only be fold once. You can easily use them because of the open bridge design. You can easily use them with uh, just one hand, but only if you don't have thick fingers. They are around 11 centimeters wide and 11 centimeters long, and they weigh around 325 grams. So they are quite big for pocket binoculars. You can mount binoculars on a tripod by removing this screw cap on the bottom of binoculars and attach a tripod adapter, but there is no need to mount such binoculars on a tripod because they are very light and the shaking of hand isn't as noticeable as with bigger heavier binoculars such as 8x56 for example. They have turnable eye cups. The turning is hard and the eye cups are stable. So if you press on them, they don't fold. And they have four positions. So this is one, two, three, and four. You can also hear and feel when they set in the position. So this is really good. They're also really good quality and covered with rubber, but they are not suitable for eyeglass viewers. Optically, they have multi-coated lenses, which means that some lenses have multiple layers of anti-reflection coatings. 
They have average field of view, which is 105 meters at 1000 meters. Image is bright and also sharp at the center, but it's not so sharp at the edges. There are also some internal reflection, but not so noticeable, so this is not a big deal. They have big central focusing knob here with a um, rubbed surface for easier adjustment and better grip. The turning is really smooth and you can easily turn it with just one finger. Focusing is fast, so this is better for outdoor activities such as hiking, bird watching, safari, traveling and so on. And on the right eyepiece you can also see that there is a um, adjustment ring for diopter, which is also quite hard to turn. So this is a good thing, so you can't accidentally change the diopter. Okay, so let's see what's included in the box. So we got this soft case for binoculars without any strap and with just one pocket for binoculars. Then you get this neoprene carrying strap for binoculars. You also get, you also get a cleaning cloth. Instructions in multiple languages. And a two year warranty. You can also get 10 years uh, of warranty, uh, additional 10 years of warranty after you register your binoculars. Okay, so we are almost at the end. Just let's check some good and bad points. So the good things about these monoculars are the, um, the great build quality as any other Minox uh, binoculars. Also the eye cups are really good, the quality is good, the turning is good and the positions so they stay in the position, they don't fold, everything is great about these eye cups. The image is sharp at the center. They are waterproof down to 5 meters, also fog proof and filled with nitrogen. They have average field of view and they are a little bit more comfortable to use, not as other pocket binoculars, because the other um, competition has um, smaller objective lens. They have uh, 20 millimeters objective lens and these binoculars have 25 millimeters objective lens, so they are more comfortable to use and also the image is a little bit brighter. And to some bad points, they are less compact, so they don't have dual hinge design, they only have a single hinge, so they just, um, they fold just um, once. And they are quite big for pocket binoculars, that is why, because they can't, you can store them in a pocket because they can't fold a little bit more. And also open bridge design, it's not suitable for those who have thick fingers. So for me, the open bridge design on such a small binoculars is useless. They also have short eye relief, which makes them less suitable for eyeglass viewers as any other pocket binoculars. They have some internal reflections and what uh, bothers me is that you don't get any eye cups or objective lens covers in the box. They cost 199 euros and this model, so 10 by 25 model, is suitable for beginners because they are compact and versatile binoculars and a great choice for various outdoor activities. As I said, um, such as hiking, traveling, camping, bird watching, safari, 
sporting events and so on. And they are not for those who want the ultimate small binoculars. So this is it. Thank you guys for watching. If you found this video useful, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and see you next time. Bye.